Giving a run for one's money, unraveling idioms. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we dive into the fascinating world of the English language. Today, we're exploring an intriguing phrase that often pops up in conversations, stories, and even in the business world. Giving someone a run for their money. By the end of this video, you'll not only understand what it means but also how to use it effectively in your own conversations. The phrase, giving someone a run for their money, is used to describe a situation where a person or team competes strongly against another, often surprising everyone by how well they perform against a more established or expected winner. It's not just about competition, it's about challenging someone who's considered the best and making them work hard to maintain their position. The beauty of this idiom lies in its versatility. It can be used in sports, business, and everyday challenges. Understanding the origin of idioms can often help us grasp their meaning more deeply. The phrase, a run for one's money, is believed to have originated from the world of horse racing in the 19th century. Betters who backed a horse expected it to give them a good run for their money, meaning they hoped their horse would perform well, giving them a fair chance at winning their bet. Over time, the phrase evolved to mean giving anyone a significant challenge in any field, not just racing. Let's see how this phrase comes to life in everyday conversations and writings. 1. In sports. Despite being the underdog, the local team really gave the champions a run for their money, leading right until the final moments of the game. 2. In business. The startup is giving the leading tech giants a run for their money with its innovative products. 3. Personal challenges. He's really giving me a run for my money in this chess game. I didn't expect him to be such a tough opponent. To incorporate, giving someone a run for their money, into your English, remember it's best used in contexts of competition or challenge. Whether you're discussing sports, recounting a personal experience, or analyzing business strategies, this idiom adds a layer of dynamism and suspense to your narrative. Practice using it in sentences related to competitions or challenges you've faced or observed. And that's a wrap on, giving someone a run for their money. We hope this video has shed light on this engaging phrase, making your English conversations even more vibrant and expressive. Remember, learning idioms not only enriches your vocabulary but also brings you closer to the heart and soul of the English language. Keep practicing, and don't hesitate to give us a run for our money by sharing your own examples in the comments below. See you in the next video.